There it is. Good fight, bro. This combination has been suggested to me by so many different people. It is actually the Dark Bow into Granite Maul combo. It is extremely deadly, and if we can do it right, we can deal so much damage that people are not going to believe what is happening to them. Literally, we're going to spank them with some serious hits, and I cannot wait to see how well it does. We're going to be doing this on a level 70 Granite Maul here that has 84 strength, 88 range, and 52 prayer. I know the prayer is decently high, but that means we can smite some motherfucking nubs out. That'd be pretty cool if we get a plus one, isn't it, guys? I mean, I... I think that'd be pretty cool. I'm pretty sure you guys could agree on that. We're actually going to be risking the Dark Bow because I want to try to give back to the pure community a little bit. I know it's a rough place and a lot of people are pretty like mean and stuff like that. But a little thing goes a really long way sometimes. So if I can risk a little bit, maybe somebody will start risking some more or something like that. I don't know, but as long as I'm just risking a little bit, that's all that matters. So I really hope you guys do enjoy this video and let's slay some motherfucking nubs. All right, guys, we got ourselves a fight right now. He says no smite. Okay, that's perfectly fine. Versus a DDS pure who probably has a Gmall. No, he doesn't. He's going for double DDSs. No. Okay, so we got to keep a little bit of a different distance from him. Okay, 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 okay. We just got to watch this. We got to watch this. We got to go for the hits. One of the things I've realized when pure PK is you literally just got to go for it. There it is. Oh, that was literally the perfect shit. That was literally the perfectest shit. We just didn't hit hard enough. Damn. All right, this build is this is going to be super sick. Okay, we're just going to have to kill him with this now. This is going to be super sick. We're going to have to keep a little bit of a distance from him as well. We should keep our prayer up. We do not want to get smited. Okay, okay, his HP is a little low there. That's probably fine. Okay, all right, all right. That's big hits. There it is. We ended up catching him. We ended up catching him with it. Good fight, dude. Lucky. Look at those hits for the mysterious emblem and everything. That was sick, bro. That was a sick-ass combo, man. Even though we didn't get the first one, but I am hyped for this video. All right, guys. So we got ourselves a rematch right now versus a fellow G Maul up here. We just fought him before. We did the craziest stack on him, dude. He ended up living it because I just didn't hit hard enough. But it was, like, so perfect to stack on it. We got to watch out for his G Maul spec. He is also a fellow G Maul. The only thing about knives is that you have to stay, like, really close to them. Nah. Nah, bro. Nah, bro. Don't tell you from me either. Don't tell you from me either. Keep a little bit of distance. I want to see that distance. Okay, look at these hits. Look at these hits. Okay, we could have went in for it right there, to be honest. We could have went in for it right there. But it would have been a little bit sketch. I want to try to get something. There it is. Good fight, bro. Oh, fuck. I seen the XP drops, and I knew that was coming. Yes, dude. This is fucking set up, man. It's so hype, dude. I am ready, bro. You know what I'm ready for? Slay some motherfucking nubs. Ain't doing it right unless you got yourself a pirate bandana. Here we are with a brand new fight versus a 60 attack peer with 99 cooking, mate. 99 cooking. This guy's got some special skills up his sleeve. He's probably got a granite maul, too. He might actually kill me. Nope, a DDS. Okay. He's a 60 attack peer that actually uses a DDS. That's definitely rare. He knows I've got the G Maul, so he's gonna he's gonna be careful. He knows a lot of people go off and shoot the G Maul like right away. Okay, we're gonna lower him down. Alright, this is what we're gonna do. Okay, we're just gonna scare him a little bit. Okay, he thought I was specking there exactly. I knew his HP was gonna be there. We gotta get him a little bit comfortable with, with getting the dark bow. Alright, there it is. Oh, we got him. There it is, bro. We didn't even need to use anything. We just got the <laughs> Oh my god, bro. This is the funniest fucking shit ever, bro. I am slaying kids. I am slaying kids, man. Let's do it. We got ourselves a rematch right now versus somebody who's got some serious BH kills, so we definitely gotta be on the lookout for him, sort of. He's gonna go in for the DDS, like, quick. He goes in for it quick, dude. I gotta do that quick. I just gotta go in and get out, man. I gotta get in and get out with this guy. He's got a lot of BH kills. He sits here all day long. I mean, I sit here all day long, too, so we're both sitting here all day long, so I wonder why we don't know each other. He's gonna eat. He's scared now, bro. Cause I used that setup. I used this combo last time. I almost got him. I literally red barred him, dude. He's going for it. He's about to go for it, dude. We gotta watch out. See, he's getting ready for it. He's getting ready for it. Okay, okay. Oh yeah, he's scared. Okay, is he gonna risk it or what's happening? What's his risk? He's not going in for anything just yet. Is he gonna try to smite me or I'm sp there? Whoa! Okay. Did he just 39 G maul me? Was that what I seen? That was really nice of him. Good fight, the Dark Bow. Fuck. I normally hate re-gearing, but the way this bank is set up, dude, I gear in like two seconds. I normally get really pissed off. I'm like, dude, I don't want to re-gear. It's fucking so annoying. Uh, 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 uh. But the way this is set up, I literally just died, and I'm re-geared within a minute. All right, so we got a fight right now versus DDS Prod. And actually, okay, so what is he using the Heart Prayer for? Okay, that's, that's, that's a little odd. He wants to stay close. Now, we're going to keep distance. 
We're going to eat here, though. We're going to watch out for his DDS. He's going to prod something. I bet he's going to prod something with his name, man. Just gives it away a little bit. No, I think he's actually not going to prod anything. He's going to go for a, a fail. What? Unless he's completely ranging. I mean, his strength is only 70. Okay. Okay. We could have G-mauled him there. I could just gym all these people, to be honest, but I want to do the combo specifically. He's got smite, too. Okay. That's two bad hits. Not too bad, though. The bad hits on the, G on the dark bow, actually. That's what I want to keep on. There goes our recoil. We could have stacked him right there. We could have stacked him right there. He risked it, too. I just want to try to get, like, a big-ass stack. Oh, he smited. He smited. There it is. Good fight. There it is, bro. That's what I'm talking about. I forgot to mention, though, I kept getting a ton of deep wilderness targets, so I had to keep skipping them, and I ended up hitting the 30-minute marker, dude. All right, we are engaged. We are engaged in battle, bro. We are engaged in battle right now versus Sitowski. Can we kill him or not? Oh, my God. He just went for it. Wow. Okay, so he just went for a huge G-Mall spec. Is he about to tell you now? Wow. Okay, sorry. Sorry. That literally just threw me off guard. I seen something coming. I knew something was about to come up. I was like, yo, this somebody's about to do something. Still 16 prayer. What the fuck are you smiting for? Because I want to, man. I've got it unlocked. I'm going to use it, man. Don't be so angry. Don't be so angry at me, man. I'm risking a Debo. All right, we good. I could have killed him right there with the G-Mall, but I want to try to get a bigger stack, man. It's no it's no fun if we don't get them huge stacks. Get them huge stacks, boy. All right, all right. What is this? What are these hits, boy? All right, we're going to go for a big one. Watch this one shot, and then... Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. His target's right there, though. We're going to kill this guy. Don't worry. Don't worry, man. Don't worry. There it is. Good fight, bro. Good fight, man. And that's a wrap. Really hope you guys did enjoy this video. This combination is absolutely insane. I know this is probably a shorter video. Actually, I really don't know how long it is. I haven't edited it yet, but it's probably shorter because I got a lot of like quicker KOs and stuff like that. But I had a super awesome time making this video, especially the fact that I just finished up a seven hour stream and then went right into making a different video. But then that took like way long. I was like, I gotta actually dedicate a lot of time to the other video. So now I just jumped into this and we made it. And here it is. We at the motherfucking end. KO'd a bunch of nubs, had a really awesome time doing it at the same time. So overall, it was a pretty good fucking time making this video. So if you guys did enjoy this video, be sure to smash thumbs up if you did. Shows me you like the video, shows me you appreciate the content, and it helps out the videos more than you guys know it. If you're new, be sure to subscribe to got new unique content coming your way every single day. And I cannot wait to see you guys in the next one. Take you throughout my journey, man. We got a big journey go ahead of us, and I can't wait to see you there. Sorry if I'm like messing up a little bit in this video, but I'm like dead tired, but I am dedicated to get videos out. So I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. I hope to see you guys in my streams because we're actually going to be going for the Twitch partnership. The Twitch partnership, bro. It's going to be a really cool milestone. Can't wait to see you there. And I'll see you guys all tomorrow. Peace.